what does my brain think trying is dangerous? Sounds like plain laziness to me. Wow, Captain Useless, you're really maintaining that perfect record of yours of always arriving at the wrong conclusions. The correct answer is because hope once got him hurt. Today we're talking about learned helplessness, the identity distortion that convinces you you can't, even when you absolutely can. It's your nervous system whispering, don't try, trying got us hurt. It's a fear of thriving, not because thriving is bad, but because thriving is unfamiliar. Your nervous system learned early that trying equals danger and giving up equals safe. And once your body believes that, it becomes identity. Fast recap time, we know the trauma loop by now. BNST predicts danger, hippocampus stores it as identity, thalamus filters life through it, watchtower panics, ACC screams error, then the angular gyrus writes the story and the temporal poles stamp the meaning. It's the same loop, but learned helplessness also drops you into freeze-based wiring. Ready for that science twist? The ACC's error detector gets crosswired. So every time you try something new, the ACC goes, error, unknown territory, retreat. Then the ACC tells the watchtower and the watchtower signals the vagus nerve all the way into dorsal vagal collapse. Freeze, shut down, numb. Then the angular gyrus and temporal poles do their tag team routine. Don't get your hopes up. You always fail. This is who you are. The identity gets cemented around the collapse. And it creates this illusion of, why try? I already know how it ends. The system gets wired for predictable misery. It knows how to survive the awful, but it doesn't know how to trust the good. So the system quietly chooses, it's better to fail safely than to succeed dangerously. This is the freeze circuit hijacking your identity. If you want the full deep dive with visual aids and what we can do about it, I wrote an article, Learned Helplessness, The Fear of Thriving, link in the description. Tomorrow, we'll talk about trauma attraction, why danger feels familiar and healthy feels wrong.